On September 20th, activists and students convened to vocalize how to fight austerity. The forum addressed a variety of issues, including tuition hikes, layoffs, impoverishment, daycare closures, police violence, and other concerns. At their most recent meeting, the regents considered a plan proposed by Mark Udoff to commit the UCs to as much as 81% in fee hikes over the next four years. If this plan goes through, tuition at the UCs will likely exceed $20,000 after four years' time. I want to take on two mysteries. One is the contradiction between, as the poster says, what austerity is, and how to fight it, which is a local immediate matter of strategy and tactics. And the other is the contradiction between the new rhetoric of austerity that followed the global economic crisis of 2008, and the fact that the implementations here tuition increases, state defunding, job cuts, service cuts, work intensification, administrative expansion, various kinds of privatization, have been ongoing since well before 2008. Today what's really needed is organizing sustained action um, driven from below like we saw in Wisconsin, like we've seen here. We really can't depend on the Democrats or the Republicans or certainly the UC Regents for justice. Undergrads are burdened with uh, tens of thousands of dollars worth of debt. When we get out, we have to, you know, spend years and years and years uh, working jobs that we don't want or jobs that, um, that, that, yeah, we don't feel are for us in order to pay back loans. As part of the Day of Action Against Austerity, members of the Public Education Coalition and supporters plan to protest Thursday at noon on Sproul Plaza. Student walkouts are slated for November prior to the UC Regents meeting. I wanted to, to get us thinking about the next steps of what do we do when we leave this room. And obviously everyone here knows about Thursday at noon at Sprawl, and we need to have a turnout there. But I think we also need to be building a coalition that um, extends beyond this campus and beyond the UC system and is looking at all... The goal is to make it more difficult to execute plans to privatize California's public universities. This has been Sarah Hayden for The Daily Californian.